Gear Score 725 is coming to New World. In today's video, I'm going to be covering how exactly you will be able to hit 725 gear score in the upcoming updates, as well as what you're going to have to do in order to get that type of gear. Before I jump into that though, let's take a closer look at the developers actually announcing this major news that's coming soon. Other big opportunity there uh, for the PvE side is the raid. So yeah, introducing uh, New World's first linear raid, so three bosses, each boss progressively harder than the last, and they require a uh, pretty elaborate teamwork from a group of 10 players to get the highest gear score gear in the game, uh, capping out at gear score 725. So the raid is a super unique experience, and I'm beyond excited for players to hop into that one. There you have it. So 725 gear score is definitely coming to New World. However, in regards to timing, we don't know exactly when this will be hitting the game but we can kind of assume that it will likely be in October and coming with the official console release. Additionally, it sounds like in order to actually reach 725 gear score, it's going to be some sort of requirement to actually take down the new raid bosses that's coming to the game. And it sounds like the new raid bosses are going to be some sort of linear fashion where there's three different bosses and each one you defeat just progresses the overall level of difficulty. So maybe you get like 710, 720, then 725 gear score items as potential drops of those. That's just a thought, but we'll get more information down the road. What we do know today is that they did have a small teaser. And again, correct me if I'm wrong here, but this looks like some sort of new boss or new enemy to the game. I don't recall seeing this in any gameplay that's out there today so this very well may be one of the three new raid bosses that are coming and by the looks of it it looks like it's angry earth so again just something that we can kind of somewhat prepare for in the upcoming next few months so that's cool and all but what can we do today to actually prepare for this new content and to prepare us for the raids to eventually help us get that 725 gear score and again, this is all brand new content. We don't really know entirely what these new raid bosses are going to entail, but what we can do is pretty much the obvious in regards to preparing ourselves as best as possible for this new content. Chances are this new raid is going to include three new bosses that are more difficult than the Sandworm. It wouldn't make much sense if it was easier. I mean, let's face it, Sandworm is pretty difficult even today, so chances are we're going to have a bit of a challenge on our hands. In order to best prepare yourself, again, pretty obvious, but try to hit that 700 gear score set or as close as possible just to prepare yourself for this new content. It's fine if it's not exactly 700, but just keep in mind that you should use this time to prepare your builds to prepare yourself for some strong, challenging PvE content. And I'm talking about implementing at least three artifacts, upgrading them to 700 gear score, unlocking the perks, making sure you have consumables ready to go, maxing out your heart rune, and anything else that you can think of that will have a positive impact in your PvE play. Regardless if you are a PvP player or a PvE player, you are going to want to take down these raid bosses, so it's worth the preparation. Just because, let's face it, 725 gear score PvP, you're going to have a better chance of taking down 700 gear scores if you're a little bit higher up. And that really covers this video. Be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. As soon as I hear more information about what's coming to New World, including the gear score changes and the new raid bosses, I'll be posting more content. Thanks again, and I'll catch you guys later.